So this Fox News alert now, we have major breaking news on one of the cases facing the former president, Donald Trump. Specifically, the documents case based out of Palm Beach, Florida. For more on that, David Spun tracking it in Washington, D.C. And David, I'll allow you to deliver this major headline. Judge Eileen Cannon has dismissed the classified documents case against Donald Trump in Florida. This is massive news. We did not see this coming at all. This is a case that she tentatively postponed to a later date. The original trial was set for the end of May. She uh, moved it back a couple of months, though not setting a date. She has just dismissed it in a 93-page court document saying that uh, Jack Smith, the special counsel's appointment, violates the appropriations clause and the appointments clause of the United States Constitution. In layman's terms, she's saying that he was not appointed lawfully and not appointed appropriately. I'm sure we're going to be hearing from the Department of Justice about this momentarily as Attorney General Merrick Garland. Garland believes that he had every right and his team believes every right that he could appoint Jack Smith as special counsel. We're going through this right now. It's 93 pages. The printer is cranking up behind me uh, page by page. But essentially, the bottom line here is that this documents case goes completely away for Donald Trump. There was a hearing that was originally scheduled for next week to talk more uh, about this appointments issue. Judge Cannon issues this on the day of the beginning of the RNC. So right now, Donald Trump still has one pending case against him in federal court that's here in Washington, D.C. That's his alleged attempts to try to overturn uh, the 2020 election. Uh, Special counsel Jack Smith received a blow to that case just a couple of weeks ago with the Supreme Court. That seems to be somewhat delayed right now. Uh, But this is big news. No question that this case